These children come from all walks of life, and like any others, full of dreams and potential that can be unlocked with one simple tool. That tool is the power of storytelling. This is Kids Read, a community-based program started by the National Library Board in 2004 to promote early reading in children from low-income backgrounds. When Kids Read was started, it had a modest goal of reaching out to 2,000 children in three years. Over the last 20 years, Kids Read has helped to spread the love of reading to more than 79,000 children. The primary goal of Kids Read is to build the joy of reading in children from less privileged households aged 4 to 8 years old and also instill good reading habits in them. Why is it so important to cultivate good reading habits for young children? It is important to cultivate good reading habits in young children because we feel that the ages of 4 to 8 years old are crucial in laying the foundation of reading, especially for those who miss out due to their own family circumstances. Reading helps children by building their vocabulary, improving their reading and writing skills, as well as building a wide spectrum of skills. Therefore, the Kids Read program seeks to expose them to a wide variety of books, which will give them different perspectives of different topics, as well as different kinds of emotions. And what exactly happens during a Kids Read session? Is it really just reading? Mm. Not really. Why don't I show you? Let's go. Okay. So now the volunteers are doing the tuning in, which will help the children to settle down and then also think about the topic for the story, which will help them understand the story better. Now the volunteer is bring the story alive through story that's called. The children are now doing fun activities that are related to the storybook as well as STEAM, which stands for Science, Technology, Engineering, Art and Math. This exposes the children to these topics early and doing it in a fun, engaging manner which makes learning fun. In these last 15 minutes of the session, the children read independently on their own using the wide variety of books that NLP provides. So that's everything that happens in the one hour of the Kids Read session. Thanks, Paul. No worries. As a community-led program, Kids Read recruits volunteers from all walks of life. However, as the program is in its 20th year of operation, there are now volunteers who come from an interesting source, Kids Read itself. Remember our storyteller from earlier? That's Yitzim, a young alumni of Kids Read who has returned as a volunteer. Hi, my name is Chirit Sim. I'm 12 years old this year and I'm a young alumni and a volunteer at Kids Read. And what I do here help the kids uh, read and pronounce books. And sometimes they have arts and crafts. And if they don't know how to do the arts and crafts, I would voluntarily help them with the arts and crafts and teach them how to do it. What do you remember about your time in Kids Read? I usually remember of the outdoors activities. One time I went to the Botanic Gardens and we made an art out of um, leaves and that really left a very interesting memory on me. And what do you think you've gained through Kids Read? I think I gained my English pronunciation and how I was able to speak fluent English. The biggest achievement of Kids Read is hearing from our volunteers that the children actually have grown the joy of reading. When the children actually become more participative during storytelling, having their first time reading a book independently on their own, or even bring their own books from home to the Kids Read session for the volunteers to read to them or to read together. And of course, lastly, the passionate volunteers that we have in the Kids Read program. What are the upcoming plans for Kids Read? NLB has decided to bring the Kids Read program down to the homes of children who are unable to travel to our clubs. And I'll be hopes to reach out to more children from the less privileged households, especially those who are unable to travel to our Kids Read clubs for our program, so that everyone can benefit from the joy of reading. <laughs>